Okay, so cable to hydraulic clutch. This is how you do it. Well, one of the options, of course, this is just an option. <laughs> I hope this is helpful. First of all, that's why I'm doing it. Okay, so you can install a master cylinder. This one comes from a Toyota Hayas. I'm going to post an image of the master cylinder in case you want to do the same thing. So anyways, you have to just drill here in the pedal, get a pin, and then just make sure you have the right position, okay? You have to take the, all the pedals out um, in order to put those two screws over there. So this one only has two uh, places where it it needs to be supported from. So it's these two uh, screws right here, okay? So the the liquid is not right next to the master cylinder. Here's where it is. Okay, then just run one line to the engine, okay? That's real simple. Be careful because you need to have the right position in, of this pin, of this push pin, because otherwise the, the, the clutch pedal is gonna be very, very um, hard, you know, very, very stiff. So it won't be, it won't be good for when you're driving. Okay, that's how you do it. On a Subaru Brat Gen 2, okay. I actually, on my first attempt, I had to drill an extra piece of pedal for more, um, you know, for more, uh, for a better grip or for more leverage. So now I'm just gonna cut it because now this one is, is you know, even with my hand, I can push it. So it's really good. It feels really good when I drive it. Okay, now this is where the liquid goes. Just You just need to do a little bracket here. This is the reservoir. It just has one hose that runs into the cabin. And that's it. That's pretty simple. The rest, of course, you will need to install a, um, your transmission with hydraulic clutch or whatever. And then just there's there is one line that goes to the master cylinder all over to the to the clutch uh, and that's it there you have it i hope it's helpful